Hi, my name is Ryan. A lot of people are searching for embed link in YouTube video and add link in YouTube video. So people want to know how to create a link on their YouTube video that will take people from their YouTube video to their website. And just to show you a real quick example of this, you can see that this is, this is an example. So this is what's called a call to action overlay. This is the way that you're going to achieve it. You can do it with, with an annotation like this right here, but annotations only take you to either another web page or another another video on YouTube or another channel on YouTube but it will not take you to a to a website you need to do what's called a call to action overlay that's what this little box is right here you can you can customize it but basically when somebody clicks on this it'll take them to your website like like it just did right here you can see it took it will take you right to your website that's very powerful because once you get people to your website then you have much more control and you can engage with that person on a much on a much different level so um, let me just show you really quickly. So the first thing you want to do is you want to go to YouTube promoted videos. You want to go to youtube.com forward slash ads. And let me just pause here for one second. So again, go to youtube.com forward slash ads. And this is where you're going to go to. You're going to go to this page. And then what you want to do is click on get started. The next thing you want to do is hold on one second. Let me just log into my account. <clears throat> So I log into my account and you can see this is where you go first. It'll take you to a screen that says YouTube promoted videos and this is where you set up your billing. Basically you're going to put your time zone in, your card number, your expiration date, all this information and I'm going to pause here and fill this out and let you do the same. Okay, so I filled in all the information and I clicked it on the bottom, you know, um, proceed or add billing. And then it took me to this screen. So now I got to set my budget. Now you want to set it to the minimum per day, which is a dollar. And don't get all stressed out or worried about this. We're, what we're doing is, is we're just setting up the system so that it, you're, even though you're not gonna, your ad's not gonna show, you still have to at least establish a daily budget. So the whole goal is, is, is to get you added to the Google, you know, the Google um, display network but in, in promoted videos, but what you're doing is, is we're gonna, we're gonna set it up so that your, your ad doesn't actually show up on other channels and it will only, your ad, your information will only show up in your video that you're actually creating. So, um, or that you have created. So just go with me here. It's $1 per day and you're not even gonna use that amount of money because what we're gonna do is we're gonna make it so that your video will not basically will not show up on any other video. So, okay, so you've got that set up. Now what we've got to do is we've got to go to create a new promotion. Okay, so we've got to click on one of the videos here and in order to add that call to action overlay to it. So I've clicked on this video and I go to, I agree. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to write my promotion. Now this is the, this is the promotion that I would actually have showing with my video if I was going to advertise or get this video shown alongside other videos that are similar to it in order to get people to click on my video. That's what this whole this whole this whole process is all about is to really get you to use the Google advertising network but you're not. Okay? So just trust me. This is going to it, it will work. You just got to make sure that you do it correctly. So write your promotion. So let's say, you know, I'm going to fill this out. I'm not going to and then you do the same. Okay, so you can see here that I put just basic information here. This is my promotion. I mean, I just put, it doesn't really matter what you have here in terms of words. You just need to make sure that you have something here so that it looks like you're going to actually create an ad for on Google. So then you click on next. You do not want to play this on your channel and then enter keywords. So what we're going to do is we, what it's asking you is, is what keyword or phrase do you want your video to show up under when, uh, and, it, for for promoted video. So in other words, if you were going to be advertising your video, what keyword is asking you what keyword you'd want it to show up with. So what we're going to do is we're going to go after such a competitive niche that there's no way that your video is even going to be able to compete or even show up on the page. So we're going to go after a keyword like watches. Okay, It's very, very competitive and there's no way that you're going to... Let me see. Hold on one second. Hmm. 
Okay. So you see, I just, I added that keyword. I clicked on add the list and then insurance quote. That's another, another word that's just so competitive. There's no way that we're going to, we're even going to be able to come close to competing with it or competing in that niche. And the reason why is because we're going to set our cost per, per click to so low that there's no way we're going to compete with the other people that are competing in this niche. Because other people, and by the way, you, you know that you only set a dollar a day as your max anyway. So, I mean, but you're not even going to, your, your video is not even going to show up. So just, again, just go with me. The max CPV is the highest value you're willing to pay each time a user clicks on your promotion and views your video. So let's make this one penny. So there's no way you're going to compete for a keyword like insurance quotes with a penny a click. I guarantee you people are paying at least five, 10, 15, 20 dollars per click in order to compete in that niche. Then you click next, and this is what the promotion would look like. And then okay, it's just click on OK, run my promotion. Okay, so now what we need to do is, hold on one second, let me just pause this. Okay, so now you need to go into the video that we clicked on because that's the one, that's the only one that you're gonna be able to create this call to action overlay on. You've gotta go back in and create a new promotion for each video that you wanna add this call to action overlay on. It's the only kind of, you know, pain in the butt part of this process, but <clears throat> basically, so I'm going to go to the, I'm going to go into my channel and then I'm going to go to my videos and then you can see this is the video that we added that call to action overlay on. So I'm going to click on that. Oops. Let me go back and let me go to edit info and here's where the beauty, here's the, here's the, the beautiful part about this. So here's the call to action overlay section. So now I can add a headline, a description one, a description line two, an image URL. This is the, the little picture in the corner there. You've got it, it's 56 by 56 pixels that you can, you can put on this. The display URL, this is the actual URL that's gonna be shown in the call to action overlay and the destination URL. So let me just fill this out for me and then, okay, so I filled, I filled out all the information. What I want to do is I want to send people to my, my company website. So what I did is I put a headline here. You want to make it show that it's that it, it, it really grabs their attention. You've got 25 characters to use. You've got 35 here. So you can see that I didn't take the time to do the image URL right now because I don't, I don't have time to do that, but I did put a display URL. So this is what's going to be showing up and this is where the destination or this is where people are going to be sent to. So all I got to do is click on save changes and then I can go to view the video on the web page, on the page, and there you go. Hi, Ryan Stiles here. Hi. So there's the call to action overlay. How beautiful is that? Now, if I click on that, that takes me, it, it takes me to my company website. And right now my, I don't know, my, my, there we go. My internet connection was really slow today. So anyway, that is very powerful. Hopefully you see how that can really apply to your business and how it can help you grow your business exponentially. It definitely has helped me you know, do that with mine. And you can actually even see how many people click on that, that call to action overlay in your insights. I'll, I'll create a video on that in the future, but please rate and comment on this video and subscribe to this channel. Thanks and make it a great day. Talk to you soon.